News of a call-up, though positive, can also be shocking, its impact taking time to sink in. Within 48 hours, this player will be in a new city and a new uniform amidst players with whom he is unfamiliar. A AAA manager welcomes a new arrival from AA. This prospect showed promise at the AA level. The organization is hopeful his progress will continue here. The 4th of July invokes a special feeling in a ballpark and sometimes in a team spirit as well. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. And today, in this video, we're going to be doing episode 5 of our Henry Johnson Road of the Show starting pitcher. And like you just saw, we're going to be making our triple-A debut. And we speak of the devil, number 66, we strike him out. out of the inning. And that's a cool moment for him on the mound as he racks up his first strikeout since coming to triple-A. Hey, one of the things you're looking for... So after that first strikeout, we're looking to come back on the second batter, 0-2. We're going to go high fastball. Catcher wants to change up, not expecting a fastball, but he's going to, apparently, umpire says he checked swinged and he went around. And then another fastball. It's a bit weird to have a fastball as your strikeout pitch, but if it's working, you're not going to change it, right? So we strike out the side in our AAA debut in our first inning, and someone can finally be able to make contact, but it's a ground out to short, and then another fastball, again, our strikeout fastball pitch at 97. I don't want to, I didn't want to, sorry, here, another slider. That's five strikeouts and six outs through two innings. And like I was going to say, I didn't want to upgrade my velocity on my fastball to the point where it's maxed out because when I was creating the player, because I knew I needed training points, I didn't just want to use my fastball like there. We hang a slider, but it still gets him looking. It might have looked too high, but that break that I upgraded because I saved some of my fastball velocity at the beginning, I added it to my break on my slider instead, and that can cause people to look right there. Great pick by third on a bad hop, but he put an even greater pick at first on the throw. So here... We've gone through three and two-thirds innings, and I haven't used a showtime pitch, so I say, why not? Let's use one already. I mean, we got a lot. We got, like, five showtime pitches, and we just burned through another one. And another changeup. We haven't used that to strike out many batters. But if it works, it does work if you use a lot of fastballs before, then another strikeout. I'll probably show the stats of how many strikeouts we get after the game. And right now, another strikeout. I mean, this is ridiculous. I think I struck out the side again. Everyone is, I mean, we might be going for a perfect game here. Another 0-2 count. That one's looped in the right field. This is a little bit scary. Right field runs over, and he's going to make the catch on a great running play. Here again, we're going to work him outside, and he looks at a fastball. We paint the bottom outside corner. Beautiful pitch. And again, it falls behind. Right on righty matchup. We're a lot better at those, and we can... You can tell there, slider, strike three. And then this guy works a full count after getting ahead 0-2, but we do strike him out high fastball. And then number two batter at, back up for this third time today. He's going to ground out to first, and then another fastball, swing and a miss on a bullet. Now 93 pitches is going to be our 94th, I believe, but it's whacked in the left field for a base hit. We're up at 94 pitches. But wait a minute, the coach... Pitching coach is going to come out to make a change. I mean, we've gone through a perfect game through seven innings. We do get the loss. Hopefully, we don't get the loss for that credited earned runner at first. We don't get the loss, but that's really painful that we pitch a perfect game through seven and we Triple can't even get the win. has been generating a lot of buzz with his stellar play of late. Excellence commands attention. If he keeps it up, visits from reporters will become commonplace. 
and an invitation to the big stage inevitable. So we're here in the training point shop or whatever it's called, and we're going to upgrade a little bit of our stamina so we can go even deeper and the coach won't take us out after a perfect game like that. We're going to upgrade one of fastball velocity, and that's all we can do, and that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.